factory update. Very exciting one. We have just received, or the, the containers are coming in uh, for our new uh, outriggers and all the ste rolled steel that we have produced. Uh, they are just arriving at the factory. Um, we had them produced at another location. They just came in. I'm gonna turn the camera around. And there you go. Uh, so we have two containers filled with lots of rolled steel. Um, so now the trick is going to be getting them out of the trucks. And here's the other truck here. So we have to figure out how to get them out. Uh, we have a, a tele, what's called a telehandler. So we're going to uh, try to lift them out. And I guess there's a bit of a, an art in how to take them out. So we have our big rolled tube, which is 1.6, and then the center tube, which is going to be the uh, outrigger. Uh, so we have a couple of them stacked uh, inside of each other. Uh, well, these weigh a lot, but they look, look like they're secured pretty well. Uh, this is the first time we've shipped the rolled steel in before. So, uh, uh, it kind of took a long time to get all the, the, the customs process done, and uh, we'll see how things work when we get them all pulled out. And then the next thing after that is going to be assembling them to the spar, uh, the, the hub, which is right here. And hopefully all the edges will line up and it'll be the exact same circumference. They should be pretty dead on because um, they actually flew here and took all the measurements. So it should be good and we'll find out very soon. Okay, so um, bad news. We uh, were going to use the telehandler to lift the steel out, and uh, apparently the telehandler broke just before the trucks arrived. So uh, we will try to have, we'll try to find another way to do this. Um, we're pretty inventive and creative here, so we'll we'll figure something out. Um, the problem is that we don't own the containers; we have to send them back to the uh, uh, to the cargo. Uh, to the free zone, and um, so we have to try and figure a way of getting these out in the next couple of hours. So it'll be a, a fun couple of hours. Yeah.